you know, with your smartphone when you went home or uh, a computer and you can download Honda's app. Yeah. Okay. And mm -hmm. the app is going to link all the smart devices into this system. Mm -hmm. And the system is newer, faster, a little more streamlined. This is an Android chip. So really great for the Android phones. And it also works with the iPhones and all the other ones out there. And so what you do, like kind of on the, the, um, the, the app or the Android platform, it's touch. So here's the apps that it comes with right away. And then this is where you would be uploading and see the new icons. It won't let me go any further since I don't have any more, but okay. you could have multiple pages. So eventually I could have, let me, a better one? Yeah. yeah. I could have Gmail, I could have Amazon, I could have Open Table, Yelp. Now you can't put Angry Birds or TV <laughs> right. because that's dangerous. That's why Honda controls what applications, what yeah, right. but it will be, so I could link this to my smart home mm -hmm. and voice activate, say, what's the temperature at home? And it will tell me and I could raise the temperature, lower the temperature, oh, okay. if I have that smart home feature. I see, I see. Or I can say, order from Amazon, bum, 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 right. okay. and have it just while you're driving, hands-free by the voice automated system. Mm. Now sometimes we need to touch it to get it, so that's what makes this nice too. It's very sensitive. So when we get to our navigation, and our maps pull up, and we need to make it, it's very fast. It doesn't have a lot while we're driving or if we're at a stoplight, we need this to happen very quickly. So when we're not starting to drive and it's refreshing and getting stuck, and again, see now this is telling us through the demo, here's some accidents. I can talk to this as well, and then it can tell me to go this way, this way, you know, so, reroute myself. So is the connectivity already in this the, display, or do you have your own? You yeah, it's gonna run off of the phone. Okay. So right. now you're gonna have, so the, the map's here, but it's still gonna need an internet interface, right? Yeah. So we're gonna run it through either the Bluetooth, or through here, yeah. a wire based, right, right? Hard, right. hard line. Yeah. And then that way it'll use your phone as like a hotspot or you know, linking itself to the internet mm -hmm. to use the internet features. Right, yeah, that, I have that with my uh, Honda car, so I know yeah. that so, this, this display is different. The, this is a slight, yeah, slightly different. Someone else said they had a Honda Pilot 2018, okay. and it's slightly different. Right. But I think because this is a demo car, and this yeah. is kind of the idea at the chip that they have now, this is Generation 1, yes. and Generation 2 will be coming out, and it'll just get a little better, a little faster, more options. Can I touch? Yes, of course. Now, this is only a demo, so it's not going to have everything uploaded because they had to take all the stuff out of the car so someone can't start it or drive it away. Oh, okay, so this is the same as my car. <laughs> mm -hmm. And so you've seen the demo calls and stuff. On your way to 5575 Morehouse Drive, traffic is light you as usual. Fun? The route via I-15 South is still the fastest. Excuse <laughs> You can jump up front too if you want to. Please, if you want to.